I'm always behind, so I don't know about other people. Here are the earrings. 270. Oh, oh, this is okay. Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel, the Shay Michelle, and I'm so happy that you are joining me today. It has been way too long. I have so many updates, but I don't even know where to start. Long story short, you can see I'm in a new location. There's boxes behind me. I'm like in a new apartment, y'all, and I got these boxes, and the movers just put the boxes here, and they're too heavy for me to move anywhere else, so the boxes are gonna stay there. I have a whole new desk set up. I bought like a, an actual desktop, and I have like stands, my normal um, keyboard and everything. So I've actually just opened an Amazon storefront so you guys can see everything I've bought, because all of this stuff is from Amazon. So it'll be also be linked below if you guys like wanna see what I have. I've officially completed nine weeks of surgery at my school. I did three weeks of trauma, which I have, my last video was on it. I did another three weeks of hepatobiliary, and then I did another three weeks of cardiothoracic surgery. And so I've decided to take this last three weeks off um, to do research just because I needed a break and I felt like I just wanted a moment to catch my breath. It just seemed like there was so much happening and it was just like no time to just, I don't know, just relax. I honestly forgot it was summer until I would like go around. I'm like, why is it so busy on a Tuesday morning? And it's because it's summer. No one's, you know, at school or at work or whatever. Rather than me, I'm like, get off the way. I gotta get to the hospital. So I'm excited for this vlog because I feel like this vlog is like, a halfway catch up, tell you guys what I'm doing and also research and everything else that's going on. I kind of wake up in the mornings with no real plans. Mind you, this is like day two of my research elective. So I haven't had that many days to wake up with no plans, but for the past few days, I've been waking up with no plans. Uh, and so that's what's going on. I woke up at 7 a.m. But I kind of laid in bed until 8 a.m. Then I went to work out. Now it's 9.52. Um, between like getting dressed and everything else like that. So actually I have to make this video for my friend. She just graduated from business school at Yale. Woo! I have to make this little congrats video that her family is putting together. Oh, 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 this is, okay. Congratulations Kendall, you are absolutely amazing. This is not giving. Uh, that has to work. I am not feeling it. So the video is done, undoubtedly not my best work. But nevertheless, that was the first task of the day. Now I actually wanted to tell you guys a little bit about the jewelry I have on. You may be saying, is she married? She's not married. Um, so an absolutely amazing company, Anna Luisa, actually sent me some jewelry and I have absolutely loved it. These are like the prettiest earrings I own at this point. I absolutely love a cute small gold hoop. And so they gave me the gold hoops. I got this really nice ring. I kind of organically gave a ring size and it ended up being my ring finger was the only one that could fit it. So here we go. Um, and then this really cute necklace. I really like how dainty it is. Um, but you guys, I'll have a code below that if you want to buy anything from them, you can get 20% off. But I really like about this company is that it's super affordable. They have pieces starting at like $39 and you can get absolutely everything there. You can get sets, you can get rings, necklaces, earrings. And they also have a really cool two year warranty that I haven't seen that, you know, if something does go wrong with your jewelry, you're able to easily like get a replacement or switch it out or something like that and they make sure to do like sustainable packaging, sustainable jewelry, everything sustainable about the company, which is really nice. So you don't necessarily have to worry about kind of like, are you putting like a dent in the environment or anything like that? Most importantly, you guys know I have, well, you may not know, but I actually have really sensitive ears and like my skin is very sensitive to jewelry. So this jewelry is made like with sensitivity, sens sensitivity in mind. Um, and it doesn't tarnish or anything like that. And it's very long lasting. So I would make sure to check them out. Let me show you guys some close-ups of the jewelry. These earrings are Cuidado in gold. This ring, I believe, is Celine also in gold. And it's really nice. It has some rhinestones. There you go. So you can see it's like little rhinestones and it's actually really good quality. And then last but not least, we have this necklace that is called Vita. 
and she's also absolutely gorgeous very dainty very cute let me get some more light in here sorry this is the jewelry i'll have on throughout this entire video so i want to tell you guys what i now do on the daily basis it's come it's almost like a battle between oh my gosh i should be resting and oh my gosh i should be getting ahead um and so i will admit i've spent like the last three four days really resting my next rotation is ob gone so i've just been really trying to watch all of the online no i was gonna say online med ed videos but honestly i found out there's boards and beyond videos for your rotations and so i've really just been trying to like get ahead on those because that i feel like will really help me i actually found this really cute weekly to-do list that i now use um to organize myself who knows if i'll actually be able to keep it up when i'm in rotations but for now it's been going great yesterday i watched like the obstetrics number 10 through 14 videos um i did I kid you not, maybe 20 minutes of Anki, it wasn't happening. For today, the goal is to watch another set of four or five videos. I wanna watch the obstetrics number 15 through 19 videos. And mind you, all these videos have names. I just, you know, they're just a little bit long, but let me tell you the names. 15 is intrapartum fetal monitoring. 16 is preterm labor. 17 is labor and delivery complications. 18 is maternal pregnancy complications and 19 is hypertension and pregnancy and honestly knowing me i'm going to try to do video 20 because it'll be the last of the obstetrics videos and um, number 20 is postpartum so i'll probably try to knock those videos out then the only other thing i have on my list of things to do is to do my anki cards i really 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 want to get a lot of anki cards done just because one i'm behind um but honestly at this point what are you not behind on Anki I don't know I'm always behind so I don't know about other people my research elective is three weeks long so I'm gonna be doing that I'm also trying to get into reading you guys so I've actually started this book called that bird has my song that bird has my wings um it was actually an Oprah's book club and you guys I'm on page 50 I've only read it for a day but I'm on page 50 and I jaw dropped to the floor. It's like an autobiography to read what it says on the cover. It's the autobiography of an innocent man on death row. I Speechless, I recommend everybody to read it. It's 10 16 y'all. I haven't even made myself breakfast. So I'm gonna make myself breakfast and we'll be back. Instead of cooking food like the responsible adult, I am not. I went to Whole Foods and bought things. Bought some cookie dough, so we'll see. Breakfast did not go as planned. And no, I didn't cook anything. So I bought breakfast from Whole Foods. Now, don't judge me, but I bought some shrimp tempura rolls. I've been loving this Van Lewis cookies and cream ice cream. So I bought some more of that. I literally eat the tub every single day. I also bought <laughs> some snackable cookie dough. At 11 a.m. I actually have a meeting. So it's 10.38 right now. So I'll just have enough time to like eat my sushi um, and then do my meeting. And then after that though, we're actually gonna do some work. I'm happy to be doing this vlog because I think it'll inspire me to get out of my apartment. I've just kind of been like staying in here lately. Between now and the last time you saw me, I've successfully eaten three quarters of this cookie dough. Um, it's noon. I'm gonna finish watching Love Island and I think I'm gonna do some work in here first um, and try to get through half of my Boards and Beyond videos before I relocate, hopefully. Time to start. First, the Doppler ultrasound, which can be placed in the mother's abdomen. The second. It is 1.48 and I'm halfway done with watching these Boards and Beyond videos. I've already watched 15, 16, and 17 numbers, not that many videos. Um, so now all I have are 18 and 19. I told myself I'd do 20, but the way it's looking, I don't even know. But it's only 148, like I said. I'm gonna take a little break. I'm getting a little stir crazy. So I actually have some Amazon packages, so we're gonna take a field trip and then we will be back. My building is having Taco Tuesday. Should I go? It's 322 and I have officially finished watching all of the boards and beyond videos today and so you guys know my other biggest goal was just to do a ton of anki um, more importantly i have officially officially finished my first container of cookie dough 
it's been like an hour and a half and I'm pretty proud of myself. I got through 270 cards today in 55 minutes. Um, I've been trying to be more diligent with like how I look at my cards and like going through them more or slower than I used to. I also, again, am like not pressed for time. So I think I'm really just trying to genuinely understand everything instead of just memorizing things very quickly. Um, so that's kind of like my new kind of approach to all of this. Um, I'm about, it's 5.30 p.m. and I'm pretty much like done with this. I just needed to take a moment to gather myself because I got off the elevator to get my tacos, everybody. Um, very happily I might say and it is silent you can hear a pin drop where are the tacos come to find out you guys know taste the 18th tacos are on the 25th I am I just feel bamboozled by myself you guys know I planned my whole day around these tacos mm-hmm so I actually ended up having myself a little study break you guys that's basically gonna be kind of the end of our day it's like 8 30 right now I think 8 8, 8 p.m. 8 30 p.m. actually I have my phone haha -ha. sorry it's 7 50 p.m. Um, and I am gonna call it quits kind of in these final moments I just want to tell you guys to make sure to check out Anna Louise with Louisa with this jewelry I have absolutely loved it so I would highly recommend you guys to check them out don't forget to look at the link in my description box and then attached I also have a code so you guys can get 20% off um, again like honestly I love how dainty the different pieces are and they're so well made um, so yeah make sure to check them out but on that note you guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next one